This week on Newfie Cotty Wampo, I attempt to show you some of our camping gear as we pack up for Logan's first camping trip. Unfortunately, Logan had other ideas this morning, but I will do a proper gear recap later in the season once we get everything dialed in. The good news is it is an absolutely beautiful sunny spring morning here, so let's get packed up and hit the road. Here's a few items we packed for our overland trip. Uh, goal Zero Solar Flashlight, JBL speaker, music is a must, LED string lights which I can use on my Jackery and they look really pretty, they don't use too much power, cast iron for the fire, backpacking stove that we will take for little trips. Inside there's two cups. There's the stove inside there. Take it out for you and it just attaches to the top of the propane. Opens right up. There was two bowls, trout chewed one and collapsible sporks. In the bottom there and they all stay tucked away. Carabiners, foldable sink, little scrub, scraper, soap. We love Dr. Bronner's. Um, I use this for everything. We'll use it for our bodies, our hands, our dishes and it's safe for the environment. I actually use these to wash my dishes a lot of the time. I just hang it off the Jeep. Sharpening stone and oil for our axe. This is my Jackery 240. It's a little small for our needs now, but a few years ago when I got it, this was perfect for us. I used it with this solar panel. That was enough to charge our phones, our iPads, our all our devices that we needed, my flashlight everything that we need, especially if it was full sun, we would have that plugged in and charging everything and the battery would be at 100% within even an hour. So it's great. Duct tape, my green Yeti mug. Green is my favorite color if you can't tell. <laughs> Lights that you clip on the pets or children and see where they are at night. Recycle bags, garbage bags, make sure you always pack in what you take out. I love the Catadine Be Free, I don't know if I said that right. Um, this little bag packs right up, you can stick it anywhere, and the filter is super fast and easy to clean, you just wash it out. The bag I actually had to clean with some vinegar and baking soda this year. It had a little bit of a smell, but I've had it for three years, no rips or tears, and it works great, and the flow is pretty fast. A tarp, always needed, Ozark Trail, foldable travel, outdoor blanket. Emergency kit with some bandaging materials, some water tablets, all our charging cords in here. And we're gonna organize this and get it packed up. Probably better jump. jump. These are hard to find because they're so small. If you look around in these, the you will find them. See? 
Normally, we plan our overland trips around visiting a new destination, a beautiful beach, or the chance to see some of Newfoundland's wonders, like icebergs, whales, or puffins. But planning this trip, I had this gut feeling that I needed to do it a little differently. One of my intentions for this year has been to live simpler, taking as much as I can back to basics, minimizing everything to just what we need, decluttering our life and our minds. When you have just what you need, you can focus on what matters most, and that is our family and the time we have together. This is a huge reason why we have made the decision to full-time travel as a family, though we are far from departing for that trip. Taking this simple one reassured me that we are on the right path. Baby's first camp trip. breakfast. trip to the woods was exactly what we needed. Nature, time, and each other. And to celebrate the arrival of spring with our new little family, 
Come here. Thanks for watching. The bare necessities. Don't forget to like and subscribe.